Mad Money Lightning Round is brought to you by TD Ameritrade, where smart investors get smarter. It is time! It is time for the Lightning Round! Quiz Mode for the Rockful Social Union! And then the Lightning Round is over. Are you ready? Ski Daddy! Time for the Lightning Round! Why don't we start with Bob in New Jersey? Bob! Hey, hi, Jim. Greetings from your home state. Uh, question here, Jim, on an obscure cloud stock. Uh, had a good quarter. The name of it is Unisys. What do you think about Unisys? You know, the Unisys is from Bluebell, where I actually went to camp. Bluebell Camp. Uh, it's where Merle Reese lives, too, by the way, the voice of the Eagles. Uh, look, it's trying to make a comeback, but you know what? I am a best of breed guy. You're never going to get me in one of those guys. I am strictly in the Fang stocks. That's where I'm going to be, and everyone thinks they're dead. That's always the case. I like them more than Unisys. Jerry in New Jersey. Jerry. Hi, Jim. This is Jerry from the Jersey Shore, the beautiful Jersey Shore. Some years ago, I invested in a small company called Smart Balance. I was on your show. You said I had good horse sense and we made some money. Now I'm asking you about a small home builder, LGIH. They make a ton of money. You know what? You still got horse sense. I like that because it's down, interest rates are low. If you have a new president, those stocks are going to come right back. So I think that's a good idea. I need to go to Dave in Connecticut right now. Dave. Jimmy Chill. Yo, yo. Booyah out of you from Hartford, Connecticut. I like these gaming stocks, and I really like Penn National, acquisition of Barstool Sports and the potential of the Barstool Sports book. But it is getting clobbered right now, Jimmy Chill. So do I run to the hills or keep buying the pit? Well, Dave, I, I heard Jay Snowden speak. That, look, Jay's the best. But yeah, but you, you, look, we're having another wave of COVID, and he's got these physical casinos, and that's not so good for business. So I think you got to let the stock come down. I mean, they did that secondary. Now you're through that price. It's okay. It's a wonderful company. But this COVID thing is just all over the place when it comes to going to a casino. And it's very hard to maintain a casino with another wave of this horrible scourge. <laughs> Can I go to Kabir in Maryland? Kabir. Hey, Jim. Thanks for taking my call. Oh. My question for you is CACI International. I like information technology tech. I've always felt that company's going to get a takeover bid if it stays here forever. I think that's a good buy. Remember, the Democrats spend just as much on the military as the Republicans, and it's been going down because people feel the Democrats are going to win the White House. Let's go to Dabney in Tennessee. Dabney. Kudos, Kramer. Booyah, Kramer. Booyah. What's going on with Cisco Systems? The well, it yields 4%, uh, but the it's an Internet of Things play, but really for next year, not this year. Uh, it, and right now, and people are, are more caught up in, in owning an NVIDIA or an AMD or, or you know, Marvell Tech, which is, you, which is making an acquisition. I mean, they feel like that Cisco uh, is really next year's story. And uh, the 4% yield isn't enough to keep it in. That's really what's going on, because it's only 11 times earnings. They did miss, remember, they did have a down a, a quarter that people didn't like last time. So that's what's happening. Can we go to Mix, Mix Man in Illinois? Mix Man! Hey, you, Mr. Kramer. Yo. Yes, booyah backwards, which seemed appropriate given the market action this week. A man, I'm a, a plan first time, a canal, long time. Panama. I'm sorry, go ahead. Uh, Oh, I'm a first time long time. I started reading your street.com articles during the internet bubble and want to thank you for the wealth of knowledge and insight you've given all us. Oh, thank gamers you, man. You've been around. Years. Yeah, that was a street.com. I started that thing 26 years ago. That took about 26 it, it years of my life just out the door. That's all right. No, I loved it. I loved every minute of it. It's fantastic. Go ahead. Let's, let's work together. My, my company reported better than expected earnings, initiated earnings guidance above consensus, and had a 10% increase in their order backlog, but the stock price barely moved. Jim, what's your view on FLIR? You know, that is a, just an absolutely fantastic security play. And we're going to have management one because I don't understand why that stock could be this cheap. That seems mistaken to me. That's a very good company. And that, ladies and gentlemen, is the conclusion of the Lightning Round! The Lightning Round is sponsored by TD Ameritrade. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag MadTweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at cnbc.com. 
or give us a call at 1-800-743-CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.